everybody, Jake with Trendspider here doing some analysis on Netflix with the daily versus the weekly candle here. So um, what we can see on the daily candle is this big symmetrical wedge starting to form. Um, we had a pretty hard bounce off the 275 area on the daily candle and then an immediate bounce straight to the SMA 20 above. There was a hard rejection here and uh, possibly more downside, especially with the gap below. Um, but on the weekly candle, what we're seeing here is actually some pretty strong positive divergence. And uh, what I mean by that is the percent range has found higher lows here, but the price found lower lows. And we actually closed right below the 50-week EMA here and uh, almost tested the support below, which was previous resistance um, before we broke out here in uh, early 2018. So. Um, this could easily be a potential uh, technical bottom, especially with this doji um, harami type setup here on the weekly candle. We are very oversold on the RSI as well. Um, the MACD isn't showing too much yet just because it is generally a lagging indicator. What we will watch for here is a MACD cross when the fast crosses the slow to the upside. Similar to what we had here, last time the MACD crossed here, we had a continued move up. And uh, when we had the MACD cross to the downside here, it was a pretty strong move to the downside. So um, all in all, long term is looking relatively decent. Short term does look like there may be some turbulence, especially with midterm elections coming up. But either way, make sure to follow us on StockTwits to get day-to-day -day updates. Thanks so much for listening in, everyone.